Hallo und willkommen zurück zu Abaddon 3 The Warborn. Ja, wir gehen dieses Mal ups, äh, zu dieser neuen Zone. Aha. Wohl nach Kirik Tor. Ähm, eins gerade aufschreiben. Kirik Tor. Jo. Auf geht's. Und Musik kann ich auch wieder machen. Kommt da was? Da kommt was. Okay. You start out being able to equip one sky. Ah, okay, das wissen wir. Um. You are getting close to Kirik Tor, an ancient meeting place of the Wild Realm. You can tell this because the trees around you are starting to get all weird and wiggly. You are walking into a vague cloud of powerful schematic uh, magic. Your training taught you immediately you to immediately recognize the spells used to hide paths and turn forests into mazes of confusion. The rebels at Kirektor now you are coming and they are prepared. The question is, what will they do? Perhaps the shaman standing on the road to the east has an answer. Chapter 2. The Rebellion. Moment. Chapter 2. Much of the Wild Realm is in rebellion against the Pact. If there is to be peace, this civil war must end. Mm -hmm. Okay. Good. Uh, Shaman Arilda. The shaman waiting for you at the end of the path is an elderly woman. Though she is old, alone and a rebel against the pact, she is utterly unafraid. She reminds you of Daum. Hopefully she won't try to kill you. She leans on her staff and gives you a respectful bow. You are Cordanor, a hand of Avedon. I am shaman Narilda. I give you greetings. How do you know my name? After your bold actions in Chimeria, many know your name. Greetings to you. Shaman Arilda nods, appreciating the courtesy. I have come to briefly interrupt your journey. I know you are here because of the meeting. The meeting? We have had a meeting with Deles. The leaders of the Farlands, your foes, have sent messages and Deles delivered them. Kalida seethes quietly. We were too late, caused down for delaying us. Nathalie emits several obscenities. What is it about Deles that he can always be one step ahead? Arilda continues. We have met with him. Now we are ready to meet with you. We have much to discuss. So Deles was here? He was. He came to convince us to fight the pack at his side. We told him our terms. He left. Now we must meet with you. Mm, you have intentionally hidden our greatest foe from us? Hidden Deles? We have done no such thing. He came to us when he left and we chose not to imprison him. I know we have committed many crimes against your laws. This was not one of them. How do you know I want to talk to you? You did not get our invitation? We send it to Everdon. She notes your confusion. You don't know about it? Interesting. We want to negotiate with the pact. Now you are here. A happy coincidence. Since Avedon hasn't sent anyone else, you can treat uh, with us. First, however, there is a problem. What is the problem? Dedalus will deal with us, but he will not trust us. He left a force of soldiers in the woods around Kirektor. We told him that this is not allowed. He ignored us. Since we may need his help, we could not push the issue. Why did Dedalus leave forces here? I think Dedalus suspects we want to negotiate with the pact. Perhaps make a peace. Deles is right. You are here after all. I think those soldiers are here to kill you before you can reach our leader. What if the enemy soldiers attack me? I would suggest defending yourself. They will kill you without hesitation. Why do you need Deles' help? Our leader will tell you himself. I want to protect, uh, to proceed to our meeting. Then I will ask only one thing. Kirektor is traditionally a place of peace for negotiation I ask you to respect our traditions, do not fight when you are here, except in self-defense. You are rebels, if it is my whim to kill you, I can, I do not intend to violence. 
today, but I will defend myself if I need to. I would ask no less. The meeting may take place. I wish you luck in evading your enemies. We might need their help, so we can't aid you in fighting them. I can open the way. I'm ready. Then I will remove the spell I have placed. It will open a path that will direct you around the many warriors waiting to ambush you on the road ahead. She mutters a few words. You hear a rustling to your left. You turn and look just in time to see trees shift slowly out of your way. The path is open. You turn back to Arilda, only to find that she is gone. Mhm. Mm okay, we dürfen niemanden umbringen. Hmm. You pass through a neglected barricade and enter the woods west of Kirikthor. The site has been has been used by the Wildrum for centuries, and you can see the remnants of long abandoned settlements and camps everywhere. Not all of these groves are empty though. There is a large camp not far from uh, to the east. Warriors are drinking, shouting and singing. You detect the traces of a tavern accent. Shaman Arilda didn't lie. There was lots of armed farlanders in these woods. A deadly obstacle between you and Kirik Tor. Mm -hmm. hmm. That's on the wand. Oga. Mm, what's this? Hmm. Ein, uh, ein Lederfeld. Ah, wachsen. Lederfälle heran. The box is locked. You could use the lockpicks to blah blah. It would take one lockpick. Okay. Aha, nochmal Drake. Zwei Stück. Standard Leather. Witzig. Und da haben wir noch eine Kiste. Äh, eine Truhe. Hm. Okay. Dann. Da ist das Haus. Das Haus ist gut, er passt auf jeden Fall nicht mit dem, was wir unten gefunden hatten, mit der Wand, ne. Aber da können wir mal rein. Was steht denn da? Ruined Tower, na egal. Aha. Flap, flap, flap. Statuette. Das verkaufen. Verkaufen, verkaufen, verkaufen! Das ist nix. You open the door. Gold. Charmed Ogre Statuette. Call Ogre. Someone's an Ogre for 8 turns. When you enter this small storeroom, you feel dizzy. It seems like simple fatigue at first, but you aren't fooled. Someone nearby is using mental magic on you, leaving you confused. The feeling soon passes. You search the room, but you don't find anything unusual. You leave frustrated and with a determination to find and punish whoever was tinkering with your mind. Hm. Okay, da werden wir sicherlich für eine Quest wieder rein und dann wird sich dein Geheimgang auftun oder so. Ja, dann gehen wir mal weiter. Da haben wir noch eine Wand. Rebels at Kirikthor. Äh, nein. Aha. Cave entrance. Na gut. The mountain under Kirik Tor is 
honeycombed with tunnels full of outposts and mines long abandoned. Someone was building a stone walkway to the west, but the work was abandoned years ago. Normally, you'd turn around and look for somewhere exciting and hopefully stocked with treasure to loot, but not yet. Something isn't right here. It takes you a moment to identify it. You kneel down and touch the stone of the floor. It is warm and vibrates slightly, almost as if the rock were slightly alive. Strange and intriguing. Aha. Mm. Uh -huh. Keep it okay, before I da runter gehe. Gucken wir gerade noch, was es beim anderen Höhleneingang gibt. Oder ist es nur ein Tor? Hm. Auch eine Trapdoor. Construct. Aha. Okay. Double Strike. Uh, and Walkers. Um, die kann eventuell damit. Yeah. Oh, da habe ich meine eigene Turret mit angegriffen. Aber gut, die machen es jetzt eh nicht mehr lang. Construct. Okay. A pot. Guck mal erst noch mal hier unten. Vielleicht ist da noch der Weg zu dem anderen. Andere Treppe, Leiter, whatever. Das, das vielleicht? Ne, da ist es. Ja. Das sind hier bestimmt auch welche. Ja. Die brauchen eine Weile, bis die hier unten gekommen sind. Und das hier hin. Äh, buff. Die anderen kommen nicht. Crumble, ah doch, da. Hm. 
regenerating ist an. Weg. Der müsste schon noch verbrennen automatisch. Okay. Hm. Schön. Diederich ist immer gut. Sind noch welche? Autsch. Ah, shit. Okay. Vielleicht sollte ich die Dinger mal gerade einpacken. Jawohl, jawohl. Okay, und damit machen wir jetzt die. You give the wheel a few turns. The chain pulls out of the ground with a loud scraping and clanging. Then the wheel gets stuck. Jetzt kommen wir sicher genau dahin. Aber anscheinend immer noch Wir sind nicht auf der anderen Seite rausgekommen. At the bottom of this series of caves, you find the source of the strange magic. Two stone statues wait for you at the far end of this cave. They shift slowly back and forth, waiting for prey. The sort of living rock is the speciality of Camarian shamans. One of them must have slipped into this place and laid a curse on the rock here. It's a fallen. Uh, it's fallen on you to remove it. Uh, as the statues turn and lurch uh, toward you, you notice a wisp of light floating around the room. It's a faint humanoid shape drifting around as it moves. M modes of soothing energy drift out of it and fall to the ground. Some sort of power source. Interesting. Soothing shade. Mm -hmm. um, so. Auch gleich wieder hier. The Rock Curse. Okay. Können wir die verbrennen? Take cold damage every turn. Ist jetzt nicht so cool. Vielleicht muss man zu dem hin, damit man nicht zu viel cold damage kassiert.
Regenerating, okay. Ist halt ein bisschen blöd, wenn man nicht sieht, wo das jetzt genau ist. Okay, müssen wir anders machen. Muss er zu dem Hy Typen hinlaufen, um erstmal den Heal zu holen. Ähm okay, Stone Dings. Müssen wir hier hin? Alle sind regenerating, aber war ich trotzdem nicht so gut. Regenerating. Um den komme ich da ja auch so gar nicht weg. Naja, immerhin habe ich die Turrets, die blockieren den Gegner halt ein bisschen. Ach oh shit. Aber ich schätze, dass die jetzt auch stirbt wieder. Aber die kann ich ja heilen. ich da noch kann. Hm. Ah, wunderbar. Okay, die müssen jetzt sich hinten das wiederholen. Er kann sowieso nur sieben laufen, was halt ein bisschen doof ist. Hm. Komm, 
leider auch nicht da dran. Ja. Nicht so gut. Ähm... Okay. Naja, der wird jetzt an den rankommen. Machen wir mal so. Äh, den muss ich ja auch irgendwie töten. The Rock Curse. Ah, schön. Regenerating. Aha. Kommt aber auch nicht hin. Doch. Äh. So. Gut, den haben wir aber jetzt auch. The two sentinels crumble into dust. The insubstantial shade fades away. The living rock of the cave grows cold and still, as it should be. The curse is lifted. Mhm. Okay. So. Was haben wir hier? Ruby, Emerald, Recuperation Crystal und Poison Resistant, Acid Resistance. Das ist doch schon mal gut. Haben wir aber einen mehr, der das jetzt dringend braucht. Fire, Vitality Recovery, Cold mm, Resistance, Curse, Curse Resistance, Poison Acid, Energy Resistance, Mind Effect Resistance ist auch sehr gut. Da gibt es halt wahrscheinlich wieder einige Kämpfe, wo die Charaktere übernommen werden und das ist dann extrem bösartig. Die hat Mental. 6 nur. Bisher hat noch niemand mit Mental angegriffen, deshalb... Aber die werde ich auf jeden Fall behalten, die, ähm... Mit Mind Effect Resistance. Mind Effect ist Mental, oder? Ja. So. Da können wir Sachen schmieden jetzt, aber ich habe ja da gar nichts Neues. Ja, mal wieder gehen. Naja, ein Ring und Erfahrung und vielleicht kriegen wir noch eine Quest. Mal schauen. Äh, dann gehen wir mal wieder raus. Direktor. Und dies Balance War Wolf. Hallo Wolfies. Okay. Ah, der läuft ja schon. Hau nur ab. Doch nicht. Der holt seine Freunde. Na ja, gut. Kann er machen.
Uff. So. Müssen wir jetzt seine Freunde holen? Holla. Hm? Machen wir wieder einen Schritt zurück. Ganz gut, aber Okay, dann... Einen wir mal. Der da muss weg. Äh, aber dann wird die von allen angegriffen, was nicht so gut ist. muss schnell weg, bevor der nochmal pustet. Ah, okay, passt. Uff. Schön. Ein Lovely Crystal. Da haben wir noch ein Lovely Crystal. Da ist eine Sackgasse. Methyst, Animal Skin, Battle Runestone. Und <lacht> Potion of Battle. Ja, wenn dann wirklich mal richtig schwere äh, Kämpfe kommen, dann kann ich halt auch Tränke verwenden. Aber bisher war es noch nicht wirklich nötig. You are on the road. Uh, Shaman Arilda blocked off. From this angle, you can see why. In the distance to the southwest, you can see a large force of warriors. You duck out of sight and spy on them. They are farlanders, a lot of them, and they are waiting to ambush anyone who walks down the road. You continue in this direction. They are sure to see you. It would be a very dangerous encounter. <coughs> Okay. Lass mal die mal am Leben erstmal. Geht doch jetzt auch weiter, aber gehen wir mal mit denen reden hier. Direktor Frontgate. <lacht> Mit der Reden. Three towers guard the path up to Kirektor. The guards within are well armed, alert and very suspicious of you. Fortunately, someone ordered them to let you by. One of them says, Hence, Defender Amori told us to let you by. He wants to see you. He's in the main hall. They have to they wave you by. Hmm. Das ist ein billiger Umhang. Ja. <lacht> Wildrim Townsman. The pact is determined. Was? To crush us. Mehr ja, sind wir. Da ist er. Und dann gehen wir da erstmal rein, bevor wir den Rest erkunden. Aber das scheint ja ein richtig, richtiges Dorf zu sein. Eine Meat Hall. Wildroom, Wildroom, Wildroom. 
Die Dinger können wir öffnen. Brot! Mehr Brot! Aha. <lacht> äh, Wildrum Rebellion. <lacht> Gucken wir uns das mal an. The Wildrum Rebellion. The tribes of the Wildrum are an old culture, proud caretakers of the ancient rites and practices. When the Wildrum joined the pact, many of the old laws and rites had to be set aside. Most accepted this, um, someone never did. In cycle 6314, four years ago, the Western Wildrum decided they could compromise their old practices no more. They wanted to control who could enter and settle in their lands. They feared settlers from the rest of the, pa of the pact would consume their wild lands and supplant their culture. This came in direct conflict with the Pact's free roads. Several roads spanned the whole continent, and Hanvas Council declared that all citizens of the Pact would travel al along them freely and without tolls. This led to more immigrants coming to the Wildrum than the tribes there could tolerate. They started to block settlers on the roads. Keeper Redbeard refused to tolerate any rebellion against the Pact's laws. So soldiers were sent to open the path. Bloodshed rapidly followed. Now, western half of the Wildrum is its own nation. It has suffered huge losses, but remains free. The Pact has neither the strength nor the will to subjugate it. Time will tell whether the free Wildrum will find a way to rejoin the Pact or become yet another Far Land. There is a long table in the corner of this hall where the leaders, shamans and other honored whoever's are allowed to eat. There's more food than <clears throat> and better alcohol. A young warrior sits in an ornate chair at the end of the table. He stands and turns when you approach. The powerful man, a tall wall of solid muscle. He is covered with scars and his armor hangs with trophies. When he speaks, all others grow silent. But he knows enough to show respect to Evadon. He gives you a small, polite bow. I am Defender Emery. I lead the Northern Rebellion of the Wildrum. I have been waiting for you, Kodano. He motions to several empty chairs. I thank you for coming. Please sit and speak with me. I have something very important to say to you. Na dann. Defender Emery. You sit and join Defender Emery. Food and drink is immediately brought to you. He insists on a meal before negotiations begin. Everything is delicious and poison free. At last, Emery belches, push, pushes his plate away and leans back. It is time to talk, Kodano. We need to talk to the Pact. We send a message. I don't think we send it to you. Why are you here? We learned you were here from the Chimerians. In the name of Avedon, I demand that you surrender immediately. We learned you were here from the Chimerians. Emery nods. I thought so. Dillis was here, there before he came here. We heard about the damage you did to our enemies. You have our thanks. You are here now. This is good. There is something we wish. What do you wish? That is the negotiation. You do something we want and we can do something you want. First, I need you to swear something. This is Kirikthor. It is sacred to us. It is a place of peace. You must swear. You will not strike anyone unless you st they strike you first. And if I don't swear... Then we will not deal with you. We turn to Deles. The pact loses the chance to end the war with us. Redbeard would not be happy. He does have a point. I so swear. Thank you, Kodano. That makes all of this much easier. Now we can talk about what we need. I have a gift for you. You can end our rebellion. As he speaks, he grows sadder and more subdued. It is unnerving to see in such a might such a mighty warrior. You realize that he is willing to surrender to you, which would likely mean his death, but only if the terms are right. So Delis has been here. Yes, we asked for help. He made us an offer. Now we will offer the same deal to you. Oh, and don't ask us where Delis is now. He doesn't trust us yet. He gave us no clues. Why have you brought me here? Because the corruption is expanding. The corruption is a land of wild, mad magic to the southwest. No humans live there. The place is poison to your kind. The only good thing about the corruption is that its borders were stable until now. The corruption is new to me. You are lucky. I have stepped inside it. It is a dark place. A disease. It infects humans with its filth. What has been happening? 
It started slowly, then faster. The borders of the corruption began to creep. A few feet one day, a hundred the next. It eats forests, villages. It's growing faster. It was stable for centuries, but then something changed. It is eating our home. We can't stop it. We need help. So you have met with Diles. We did. He offered to solve the problem. If the rebellion joins the Far Lands, we don't want to fight alongside Chimerians. Uh, yeah, okay. We don't fight, want to fight alongside Chimerians, but we will if we if it would save our lives. We'd rather deal with you. What do you want? You have the power of evident magic, uh, evident magic, knowledge, strength. I think you can enter the corruption. You can find why it is growing and stop it. The rebellion is already failing. I admit it. The corruption wants to take everything. Here's our offer. If you save us, we will meet with the pact. We will negotiate surrender. The pact will have one less foe to fight. I know you want this Evadon once it too. So does Redbeard. Kalida says, this is a surprise offer. One with great potential if you are sincere. Ethely is amused. This is a lovely bit of windfall for us. Emery, also, it's been a long time since I found a magical puzzle that would really challenge me. I will do that. I will do what you ask. Then we can start now. Ask me and I will tell you where to go. It is a hard problem. I think we know things that can help. One other thing. One of our evidence scouts is lurking outside... Of your evidence scouts is lurking outside Kirektor. Thinking he is clever. Leave. And I think he will have a message for you. I want to discuss this mission with you. Every rebel in the vicinity is listening to your dealings very carefully. I am glad. I hope you can help us. I have some knowledge. I think that I can direct you. When did the corruption begin expand? We don't know. We think it happened for a, a while and we didn't notice. Then we did notice, but we pretended we were wrong. Then we finally saw the truth, but much land had been lost. We think it started about three years ago. How far has it expanded? It varies. The border is long. The distance changes. At worst, it was sent... If it has sent feelers over 30 miles into our lands. That is a small loss, but the expansion is not slowing down. It is speeding up. We need to act. Have you done anything to try to stop it? We have done all we can think of. Rituals, burning lands, potions. Every, every ritual our shamans know. Others were made up. Uh, we made up. We have learned almost nothing. The corruption makes us feel small next to it. Have you seen anything unusual along the border? At last we can help you. We have sent many scouts. Some die, most return, knowing nothing. But there, at this point, he brings out a map and points to a location along the border. One scout saw shades there. Mistly spirits wandering the border. They fade in and out. One scout saw them. They approached. The scout fled. The shades dropped at the corruption's border. This is very odd. This is a good place to look first. I wish I could help more. A new location is, has appeared on your world map. I have another question. You sit and continue speaking with Defender Emery. You do not suffer for lack of fine food and drink, ale, wine and tea, roast meat and savory stew. Constant vigilance is required to keep your servers from putting more before you. Emery says, what else do you need? Kodano, this is a dangerous time. I want to discuss the mission with you. Every rebel in this vicinity is listening. Okay. Blah, 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 blah. I have another question. Um, I want to talk about the rebellion. Defender Emery is immediately on his guard. We are on opposite sides. And I'll talk politics if I have to. I won't say anything that will hurt my soldiers. How is your army doing? We are tired. We've been beaten down. It's not a secret. The Pact and the Chimerians have killed many of us. We are not cowards or weaklings, though. We would never have thought of giving up. Not until the corruption started to spread. What are your dealings with Diles? I hate Diles. We hate the Pact. But we hate the Farlands more. The only reason we listened to that killer is that the corruption is too horrible. We can't fight it. We can only watch it eat us. Why did you rebel? We all have our own reasons to join. I will talk for myself. The pact built free roads all through the Wild Realm. They said any who want to travel on them, uh, they said any who want to travel on them can. This sounds like a small thing. You didn't face the brigands that came, the settlers who invaded our sacred lands, the merchants selling our young things they should not have. 
You cared enough about this to go to war? I can't count all of the outrages we suffered. It was too much in the end. We knew we had to do something. Otherwise, the Wild Realm wouldn't exist anymore. Only its name. None of its meaning. Do you regret the rebellion? Defender Emery looks away for a long moment and think. Then he says, no, I don't. I have buried friends, family, been wounded many times. In the end, you will kill me. Still, no, never forget, Hand. If you do, my grandchildren will be fighting a war with yours. Uh, what are you trying to gain now? As much as we can. We will send negotiator negotiators to you in the end, I think. Not to Avedon, but Hanva's council. We'll grab as many rights as we can. They will give us something, I think. To keep us from going to war again. I know your side wants our lands back. I ask you, what should the terms be? Mm. Mm. There will be peace when the worst of the traitors have paid. Yeah. It is a beautiful dream, leaders. Leaders like me and Arilda die, then forgiveness. Peace. One happy wild drum again. It is a beautiful dream. I don't think it will happen. Our descendants will pay for many generations. I have another question. I'd like to know more about Kirektor. Once it was a fortress. It is easy to defend. Tribes would fight bloody battles to own it. Owning this place meant owning all the land around. When the Wildrum came together and those who wanted to fight went to Cameria. Now it is a peaceful meeting place. Rivals come for uh, competitions. When there are grudges, they are settled here. This is an old and precious place with its own special traditions. Competitions? Sports, races, boxing, contents of will between shamans. Some come and camp here for entertainment. During peace, something would happen here every day. He looks away. It was a festival all year. It was beautiful. I will never see it again. Settling grudges? Our tribes fight constantly. When the anger leads to blood, the shamans force the fighters here. They are, they are, they are made to settle their fights, sometimes with duels, with blood, whatever it takes to bring back peace. What special traditions are followed here? Peace. There is no fighting here. This practice is old and sacred. Life in the Wild Room is hard and dangerous. Of all our northern lands, only here can you be truly safe. Another question. That's all for now. Defender Emery Knots. I will be here if you need to talk again. For now. Mhm. Mm so eine Erfahrung. Uh, okay. Wir brauchen noch 270. Emery, Warrior, Warrior, Warrior. Das ist wahrscheinlich einfach nur Eingängen von außen. Ja. Nein, links war keine Tür. Okay. Warriors Tower. Deso. This storeroom is a meticulously clean, with a boxes perfectly stacked and neatly arranged by size. You come across a thin little man on his hands and knees, scrubbing the seam between the stone blocks that made up the floor. His thinning hair bobs around in time with the vigorous attention he's giving the floor. When he sees you, he points angrily behind you. I'm Dezo. I'm the caretaker of Kirektor, not that anyone minds me. Look at the dirt you just dragged in. Look behind you and don't see a thing. Do you want the corruption to come in here? Now I have to mop again. In future, can you at least try to be careful? I'm a hand of Everdon and I'll track in as much dirt as I please. Sorry, I'll be careful from now on. Good, you will remove your shoes. Or wear these. He hands your little paper booties to wear over your shoes. You feel like you're 10 years old again and being lectured by your mother. You wear the booties in his presence. These are not better. Hmm. What are a caretaker's duties? He points around at his cleaning supplies. That should be obvious. I clean and keep order everywhere in the fortress. How long have you been doing this? 
For generations, when my family has cared for character for centuries, armies come and go, but we are always here. I have another question. Uh, what has the corruption spread here? Also, Dezo is still furiously scrubbing away at invisible spots on the floor. This better be important. I'm busy cleaning. The corruption will spread here if I don't keep on top of things. Has the corruption spread here? Not yet. I might jump. It might jump up here any day. That is why I have to keep on top of my cleaning. If everything is clean, we'll stay safe. You are a long way from the corruption. From what you have heard, it's not impossible for it to, uh, to jump this far. Also, the corruption can't be defeated with a broom and a mop. Uh, you're crazy. Scrubbing won't hold back the corruption. Do you have any evidence that the corruption is spreading this far north? His face lights up. Yes, there are imps. I could use some help cleaning them out. You could do some good. Tell me more about imp problem. They are filthy. I can't stand even looking at what they are doing to our reservoir under the fortress. I've complained and demanded Theresia send her warriors down there to clean them out, but she refuses. She doesn't understand the danger we run in if I don't clean up the mess they've made. If you get rid of the imps, I will give you the finest gauntlets from our storerooms. I will help with your imp problem. What do I need to do? Kill them so I can clean up down there. They are all by the reservoir, no doubt fouling our water supply. But first you will need a con uh, to convince Theresia to let you go under the fortress. It is locked and she has the key. If she gives you any problems, tell her I sent you down there on vital fortress business. I have another question. Okay, mehr brauchen wir nicht. Scrub, scrub. Not clean enough. Mm -hmm. Not clean enough. Mm -hmm. Dezo is the caretaker for carrying Thor. He asked you to help him clean up some of the mess in the old stronghold. There's an infestation of imps in the lower reservoir. He asked you to find a way downstairs and clean them out. Baldrum Warrior. Haben wir hier irgendwas? Das ist alles not yours. Das können wir auch nicht mitnehmen. Ups. Das ist Theresia. Old Room Warrior. Da ist nix. Arla. Und da geht's raus. Jawohl. Hier war er noch. Da liegen zwei Fälle. Mm -hmm. Tarla. Most of the rebels are pretending to welcome you, but this warrior refuses. When you approach, she says, I am Tarla of the free lands of the Wildrum. I will never drink with tyrants. She turns away. I need to hire you. A Wildrum archer is standing at the head of this long table. The rebels wear no insignia, but she is clearly a leader here. The other warriors watch you nervously as you enter, waiting for her command. As you approach, she stares at the tabletop. She says, without looking up, I am Theresia, Hand. Now I am a true warrior of the Wildrum. Emery ordered me to deal with you. State your business. Dezo asked me to clear out some imps from your reservoir. Good. You appraise his paranoid delusions. I will not waste the time and lives, lives of my warriors on them. But I suppose you are trying to help in your way. You will need the key to the reservoir. She takes a key from a ring and gives it to you. Never mention any of this again. Greetings. Eresia starts to snap back at you. Her face is flushed and her hands shake slightly. You brace yourself. Then she slumps into the chair. I keep forgetting everyone has given up. Why should I fight when they won't? Greetings, Sands. I have a, s have a seat. Have some tea. Emery ordered me to give you your quarters and deal with you, so I will. I'd like to know about the rebellion. Why? So you can gloat? Emery told you everything you need to know. We are weak, beaten, down docks. Now we beg for traitors' uh, favors from Everdon, just like in the old days. Then you will come for me. What do you think will happen to you? The war will end, your kind will take me in for justice. I am only a soldier, so you might spare me, even though I will never beg for mercy, ever. Or did you join the rebellion? I am not a talker. Find Arilda, she is all flowery with her words. She can, 
she can tell you better than me. I have another question. You have quarters for me? We are at Kirik Tor to negotiate. Tradition says you get quarters. The North Tower fell out of use when the rebellion began. You can have it. She slides a key across the table to you. Then she gives you a little smirk. I hope you find it lux luxurious like you're used to. Mm -hmm. You want to deal with me? Well, Emery is making me. You hands are mercenaries, right? Killing for coin. We have unfinished business duties before we leave here that we don't have the strength to do. Like there are caves nearby. When your, our force came here we found spies sneaking out of them, chimerians. We killed some and the rest escaped. We don't know what they did in that cave, but when we sent scouts in they didn't return. I will pay you if you enter the caves and find what chimerians did and undo it. Where are these caves? Due west from where we are sitting, there are several old standing stones just outside. Those caves were used for something a hundred years ago. Ja gut, haben wir schon gemacht. What did the Chimerians place there? I don't know, maybe nothing, but I doubt it. Chimerian raiders have been all over the land since the war started. They know we are weak and the pact, pact won't help us. How do you I undo whatever they did? She laughs. Your hands. All your smarts, all your tools and tricks, I'm sure you'll have no problem. That's all for now. Closing up shop. Theresia's a rebel warrior in... Moment. Quest. Closing up shop. The rebel warrior in Kirito before the rebellion ends. She wants to pay you to help clear up some unfinished business. Infiltrators. We are seen around the cave not far from the west of Kirik Tor. Theresa believes that there placed some sort of trap or curse in the cave. Investigate and find the truth of this. The Chimerians placed some weird curse under the Kirik Tor. I removed it. Also, sits at the table. She is resigned uh, to your presence. So she has warriors bring tea for you. Still, they would all sincerely prefer if, uh, if you were somewhere else. Yeah, I removed it. Describe what you did. Theresia nods. You're tyrants, but at least you can get things done. Emery told me to pay you fair. And we're true to our words. She gives you a lovely short blade and a pouch of coins. Then she's silent for a long time. Finally, she says, There's another task. Not for Emery or the rebellion. For me. I hate asking her hands, but only you can do it for me, if you are interested. Hmm. I'd like to know about the... Uh, you have more work for me? Yes, but only if you have been to the Green Refuge. Have you? You Don't lie. I know of it, though it is a secret. A hidden Avedon outpost to the south. If you ever go there, come back to me and I will hire you. Mm-hmm. Theresia in Kiriktur. Okay. Gut, dann werden wir als nächstes mal die Level-Ups machen, verteilen und dann werden wir... Anscheinend geht es damit runter und nicht hoch. Ja, dann werden wir danach da runter gehen. Ja, also schauen wir beim nächsten Mal weiter. Bis denn!